traded up to the number 102 pick with the Seattle Seahawks. The pick is in. And with the number 102 pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, the Denver Broncos select Troy Franklin, wide receiver out of Oregon. Okay, guys, I have been saying that this isn't a pick I would have endorsed. I'm not a huge fan of this pick just right off the bat. I have some issues with Troy Franklin's separation. I have some issues with his route running. I have some issues with his catch abilities. He had nine drops last year, according to PFF. Let's come over here and let's bring in some of Troy Franklin's numbers. I haven't done a full throw, like, great evaluation on him but seeing him on tape while evaluating Bo Nix I did not come away extraordinarily impressed but let's go ahead and get get his stats on in here guys sorry guys just pair it with me here here we go Oh, sorry, guys. You'll just have to bear with me here for one second. There we go. So looking at his stats from last year, he had an 84.9 PFF offensive grade. Receiving... Six foot three, 187 pounds. Last year, he had 1,383 yards catching balls from Bo Nix, 14 touchdowns. He was out wide for 355 snaps, or 80.9% of his snaps. 18.2% of his snaps were in the slot. His average depth of target, 12.8. Yards per route run, 3.32. So, again, they ran a lot of screens a lot of short stuff there in uh oregon so yeah not exactly um not exactly stuff that you can really take away from the stats themselves nine drops last year which is again very very concerning a 10 drop percentage his long catch was 84 um again man i do think that if there's anything that gives me some confidence about this pick, it's the fact that he played with Bo Nix, and Bo Nix has good chemistry with him, knows him well. The Broncos were willing to part ways with that draft capital to trade up, but let's just say it's not the move that I would have made. All right, guys, let me know your thoughts on this pick. Do you guys have a positive opinion on this, or do you guys feel like the Denver Broncos kind of reached here? I think the Broncos kind of reached a little bit here on Troy Franklin. There were better wide receivers on the board for me, including Johnny Wilson out of Florida State. But at the end of the day, this is a move that brings Bo Nix some supporting cast members, and it is a move that could potentially indicate that Cortland Sutton is on his way out the door. All right, guys, be sure to leave a like on this video as well as subscribe and ring the bell so these videos appear in your notification feed. And until next time, guys, I'm your host, Gage Madrid, saying peace out.